Hey guys, so I'll be showing you um, my new build. Um, so this is a zombie apocalypse, zombie apocalypse truck. So I once made a zombie apocalypse truck, but this is the zombie apocalypse truck, zombie apocalypse truck number two. So this is new and improved, but this time it doesn't have any weapons. Um, it just runs runs over all the zombies, and if a zombie comes and attacks it, it's got side panels, it's got armor, and as well, there's a person that I, that I um, got with it to shoot the zombies. He just has a regular gun and rifle in his hand, he goes, shoot the zombies out the way while the driver knocks them out of the way <laughs> crushes them so in the photo of the video you might have seen the reason why is to actually put the minifigure in and second of all um not just to like do this um to like actually put this and then see where to put it like this and there's a bit of storage so I'll just take these out this out first so in the first one there's just pile, piles of bomb bombs same in the other one just different colors So I just put this diagonal for like a design and there's this front um bump like this just flat. You know why? Cuz when it comes so fast um the like the spiky ones just make like a cut on the zombies but the flat ones just crushes them <laughs> like crushes them hard like this <laughs> so the side panels so i didn't really make them that hard so let's see what happens if i take the side panel let's see if it's safe without side panel well it still seems safe it seems safe but let's see if it's seriously the person you can just go under it, take the wire wires off, and then boom, it can't move anymore. And then when the driver comes, the zombie will attack you, or the enemy will shoot you. Just like that. Put you. So. Now let's just put the side panels back on. Wrong side one. So I put the side panels on. Now let's continue. So and the reason why I put side panels for the wheels is because zombies have a strong bite. They could pop the wheels. And these are for like fire flames and these are exhaust pipes um, up here. Both of them are there for a reason because the zombies can come and bite the exhaust pipes off and then the car would explode. Because then it has it like fires in on the wheels and then the wheels explode and then it might be on the the mountain and then it falls down then it breaks very long story 
and I put armored plating as well on, on the door. So yeah, um, let's play now. Let's see if this is really strong. Mm -mm. Okay, that is strong, faster. Ow. <laughs> okay, that was strong. Ah, I thought this would break. My hand hurts now. Let's do a drop, drop, drop test. Because I did do a drop test before and it didn't break. Let's see if this one would break. Dun -dun. Okay, so there might be a reason why it did kind of break. Because this is only connected by... Oops. <coughs> I guess that was kind of loose. So I guess this might not be good for a higher drop test. Holy moly, even the cargo fell out of its place. <laughs> uh, I don't think this is really good for falling off. If I'm not doing the drop test in this again. <laughs> so... Let's have a race now. Let's see which one's faster, the minifigure or the car. Vroom, vroom. Vroom. Let's do actual speed. And this is slow motion. Otherwise your eyes will, in a blink of an eye. Whoa, like this. Woo, in a blink of an eye. Okay, that that's a blink of an eye. So yeah, I hope you guys like it. Subscribe to see my videos. Bye guys.